Gaming comrades, it is your boy Daily here, and today we find ourselves in yes, Soviet Russian fortress. Uh, yes, it's very nice, smash like. Uh, <laughs> what's up, gamers? It's your boy Daily Tactics here, and today we're gonna be playing a little bit more Ravenfield. Oh my God, the PPSH one is an absolute beast! Holy cow, we are tearing it up! What the heck, dude? Oh my goodness. So, as you can see here, we have basically just a gigantic fortress wall that the Germans are trying to get into on uh, the Soviet front, the Eastern Front, comrades, of World War II. So, it's already hectic. It's already crazy. I've only got 15 bullets left. I would appreciate it if you guys would go ahead and smash the like button. Subscribe if you have not already. And comment down below if you'd like to see some more crazy raven field action by the way guys uh it was my birthday the other day and i saw a lot of people wrote me some really kind birthday messages uh but all of the videos i had recorded were all pre-recorded so essentially uh i haven't made a video since then uh because i decided to go home to massachusetts for a little bit um uh, to see my family before Thanksgiving and things like that so uh, you know I just want to say thank you all for the for the very kind messages and stuff like that I saw a lot of people uh, you know just saying kind nice words oh our T-34s are exploding comrades uh, so just thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart I really appreciate it. you guys are you guys are absolute chads mad lad chad lads I do appreciate it big time um, either way, let's duck back down here. I'm gonna try and get in an, on an MG42 here. Beautiful. Uh, but yeah, now I'm all out of pre-recorded videos out. Oof. Oh! So, all of the videos that you'll be seeing, uh, from now on on the channel will be recorded, uh, and released within the same sort of day or two, basically. <laughs> uh, actually, Zelda is visiting, which is very fun, and we're planning on doing a podcast episode of the Daily Tactics Star Wars podcast, where we sometimes talk about Star Wars, but lately we've been talking about other things instead. Um, so if you guys want to go ahead and uh, ask her some questions in the comment section of this video for us, uh, you know, questions or just topics for us to talk about in the uh, podcast episode, that would, that would be very boogers. Very poogers indeed. Yes, very nice. Okay, we kill those guys. Very cool. And we keep pushing left, comrade. Oh my god, they just keep coming in. I think, honestly, we are we are hanging on by a thread here. Oh, the T-34s are respawned. Go, go, go. Get to cover. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, comrades, I have stolen MG-42 from enemy. Very nice. Okay, the right side, they're not really coming in over there, but the left side... Is atrocious. Wow, this thing is very bad if you're not using the bipod, but uh, we're actually shredding. Oh my god, never mind. I take it back. We just did some nasty, nasty things to these boys. All right, the reload is a long time. We kind of knew that would be. Yeah, it's a little bit better when you have it in its bipod. Just spam them. Oh my god, it's like the beaches of Normandy, but instead, <laughs> instead of D-Day, it's there's no water. It's like far easier than that. No, they blew up the T-34s again. Bruh, I want to actually use those, believe it or not. Oh, that's really a pain in the butt. All right, fine. Um, let's push forward here. Let's use one of the, the defensive MG42s. These ones only have 50 bullets attached. And then that, wow, they go through fast. Holy cow, all right. That's not nearly as good as the handheld MG42 that the game provides. All right, are they, oh, T-34s, yes. All right, come, comrades. We get in and we move. Very nice, yes. Ah, look at this. Okay, T-34. Boom. Oh, okay, it's not maybe as good as I thought it would be. What is this? Do we have two turrets? Wait, hold up. Oh, we do. I think one's armor piercing and one's an HE shell or something along those lines. But we do get two shots. Ooh, at a time. And so we could switch between the two. Oh, man, they're really getting through here. Um, What are we stuck on? Oh, a little tiny wooden box. Little tiny wooden box. Yes, I have heard tale of that. That is the ultimate defense against T-3476. And I blew up. Oh, another thing I did kind of want to talk about um, was XCOM 2. I've been having a ton of people asking me when XCOM 2 is going to be returning. Basically, I'm having a lot of problems actually getting the mods to work. 
Uh, so I promise I'm working on it, but it might be a couple more Mondays before we have an XCOM 2 episode. I just haven't had a ton of time to because, you know, family, it's Thanksgiving is coming up, Zelda's visiting, all that stuff. So I don't want to spend, you know, hours at my computer basically trying to get a mod to work. Uh, I'd rather be playing fun games with you when I have a chance to be at my computer and then enjoying my time uh, with my lady friend and my family beyond that. So we just won. I, I say we switch over to the attacker side and see if we can't get the Dubsky here against this fortress. Jawohl, I am German. I can't do a German accent. Dude, I can't do any accents. <laughs> Either way, mass charge across to the Great Wall Fortress here. Come on, boys. Let's get rid of the HUD. Let's just make it absolutely beautiful. Come on, lads. Keep it up. Go, go, go. Let's kill these commies. Very nice, very epic. Oh, yeah, we are dropping like flies a little bit, but we're getting closer and closer. They do like to send out a few patrols to try and uh, mess with us. Wow. Oh, I'm so sorry, wheels. <laughs> the accuracy on this thing is absolute garbo, dude. All right, jump over. Oh, watch out. Oh, we take control. Oh, we killed Blitz. No. A YouTuber. Dude, what the heck? How did none of those shots hit? All right, we push in. Go, 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 go. Woo! Okay, we're fine. We're fine. We are outnumbered like, I think it's like 100 and... Or no, we outnumbered them 150 to 50 or something along those lines. I didn't change up the... Uh, the way the battle works at all it's the exact dang it yeah no it's the exact same battle uh, uh sort of set up as when we were defending so this should be the exact same uh except now we're attacking so uh clearly we're gonna be doing pretty well we're not even at the top of the leaderboard on our team no we're at the bottom <laughs> oh that's so sad probably because i killed a man who was on our team that's a uh you know i don't think that's too appreciated by high command but they're just gonna have to get over it because they know I'm the best soldier they god dang diddly got, man. Look at that. There's a three piece. There's a three piece. There's a three piece. And I'm out of ammo. Okay, we got the three piece though. Can confirm three piece acquired. All right, Eagle Lost Battalion. Let's get back to the HUD here. Um, ow. Ow. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ah! Ow! Someone is shelling us, and I, I think it's a tank. I think they got one of the T-34-76s out there. Just absolutely shelling us down right now. There we go. We got Gong. You're dead, Gong. There we go. There's VO. Ooh. Okay. Push in. Push in. Get this flag. Come on, boys. Ooh. That's a lot of enemies. I'm just gonna... Eh. I'm just gonna... Eh. No! Oh. All right. We got the FG-42A uh, Luftwaffe weapon, a Falschemjäger weapon, sorry, not Luftwaffe, Falschemjäger, uh, probably one of the coolest weapons of World War II, to be completely honest, it's, it's very pog, didn't see a ton of use until, until, uh, late World War II, and even then, it was a pretty exclusive weapon, I think, for the Falschemjäger, if I'm not correct, uh, let me know in the comment section below, I just believe that's the case, um, okay, so, we're, like, securing, oh yeah, we're pushing in, it's really just that they keep on, spawning in at their flags back here and so we're unable to take them uh but we are completely slaughtering them in terms of their numbers okay but no see you get close enough to take it oh i was killed by my own man never mind oh what a, what a turd dude i was literally there and my own trooper killed me what the heck oh my god the problem is we get into the flag area and then they instantly ko us so it's not great all right, the enemy's only got like 60 troopers left. We have clearly dominated the battlefield this time around, whereas last time around, we did the dominating as well. So clearly, player diff, daily diff on the team here. Beautiful. Yes, daily diff, of course. How many kills do I have? 17, that's not even that good. Okay, that's not, that's really not amazing, but I guess it is what it is, you know? Don't you know? Okay, we're gonna... Take out the grenades. I try this every time and it never works. That one over the map. Oh! Why? Every time! I'm baby raging, dude! I get there and I get no support from my team. My team has no care in the world for my safety or care or condition. They just don't help. The final objective is in our sight. We are there. We are taking it and they do nothing. They do. I have to pull. All of the weight of this team. Oh, now they take it as soon as the enemy only has five soldiers left. Oh my god, you guys are a bunch of butthead cowards who don't know how to play the game. You're trash, dude. You're trash. All you Germans are trash. Absolute garbage. Garbo farbo, dude. Oh my god. All right, guys. <laughs> That's gonna be about it for today's video. Just a fun one. Um, crazy little World War II fortress here. I hope you enjoyed 
please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and comment down below, uh, um, uh, comment, um, poggers if you made it to the end of the video, yeah. Alright guys, I'll see y'all later, peace. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Be sure to click that subscribe button for more content, and hit the notification bell if you'd like to be alerted to whenever I live stream or upload. Thanks so much.